Hi right, guys, in this video we're going to be looking at um, some tips and tricks on using a flash drive and the download button or a few things that's good to keep in mind and this will be for TrueCut RD Works but before that let's have a quick intro first So today's video can be found on softwaretraining.co.za we make short and easy to watch problem solving videos and we also have daily updates. Otherwise, back in the program here. Now, just a quick reminder, this is a mini series on tips and tricks and I will also leave relevant links in the description so you guys can actually follow along. Now, when it comes to the USB and, and uh, or USB flash drive and the download feature, it's a few things to keep in mind. So now, if you want to save something, let's say to a flash drive and then upload it onto your machine, you're going to have to use the save to you file feature now um, something to keep in mind the file format has to be rd if it is rld with a flash drive it will not work so that is something to keep in mind and also another thing on the download and so forth when you're saving your file make sure it is or should i say make sure it does not exceed eight characters so it needs to be eight characters or less in order for the machine to actually recognize it. And uh, yeah, that's pretty much it. So just a quick recap. So if you're going to be using something like a flash drive, you'll be using the save to you file button. If you're going to be uploading through, a, let's say, Ethernet cable, you can use this download button. And then it ha file format has to be RD, not RLD because RLD will not be recognized by the machine. And then also the characters for your file that you're saving it as, the name of it, has to be less or eight characters and less. But otherwise, that is it on this little video. Um, if we had to head to the website softwaretraining.co.za, you guys will notice we've got a variety of different softwares to cover, and also you can isolate your search on the top right. If you do not however find the training videos you're looking for, just go here, request a training video, fill in the mini form, and then we'll do our best to try and make that video for you. But otherwise, thanks guys for watching, and cheers.